What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to basically tell you how to fix every kind of crashing, lagging or freezing issue you're currently having with Deep Rock Galactic. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step by step tutorial and in the end you'll perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want you guys to know or let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel, it would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys, you would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say, let's get right started. So the first step I would recommend doing for everybody is gonna be to navigate down to your taskbar, we're gonna right click and open up your task manager. What I want you to do next is gonna be to simply navigate to the top left corner of your screen, clicking onto processes. Once you click processes, I want you to simply end every single task which is currently running. I know it's going to sound weird, but trust me, I will explain it to you. So I want you to end every single task for two reasons. First reason is that too many applications, programs, background processes or games running at the same time on a low end or bad PC will cause your game to crash, lag or freeze because your PC can handle that anymore, obviously. And the second reason, like it was for me, there are some applications, don't ask me why, which are currently third parting your game, running in the background or somewhere else, causing it to crash or to freeze in some way. So just simply end every single task and you're going to avoid this issue. You're going to help you a lot with this. Once you're finished, end the task manager again. And afterwards, search an empty spot right on your desktop. You're going to right click and simply hit display settings. Afterwards, I want you to stick around display and navigate right onto this side where I want you to identify which your main monitor is and obviously this just applies if you have more than one. So just simply identify it and scroll down where you're gonna uh, stick around scale and layout. I want you to change the size of text apps and other items to 100% as recommended and the display resolution should be the same as in game. So for example, if you have an in-game 720 by 1070, I also want you to apply this to your display resolution. Once you're finished, end this task and navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen where you're going to click into this window symbol and onto settings, hit update and security and stick around Windows update. And I know guys, it's going to sound a little bit basic, but trust me, updating every single driver you could possibly update on your PC will help you a lot of every kind of issue you're currently having and also with crashing, lagging or freezing and just download the latest version of Windows. It will help you a lot. Afterwards, end the settings and navigate right to your graphics card driver. Uh, hit the application, hit the browser and simply download the latest version of your driver. This will help you a lot and this provide, is providing the best possible performance in general for your PC. That's it for the video guys. I hope that I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. And yeah guys, I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just trying to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.